Hello, Phil the Meerkat here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Pray Crash Bandicoot um, and Saint Trilogy. Well, since I've got plenty of lives, um, I'm going to tackle the, the boring stuff I don't like. Or the annoying stuff I don't like. First, so I'm going to get all the boxes and then uh, do the time trial. But actually, first, I want to show something off. Doesn't really matter what speed you're going at here. What matters is this. That was a very suspicious looking sign. I mean, it had an alien on it. So. Oh, I do hate this level. I really do. I really ought to do it twice. So, yeah. You have to get all the boxes here. This is a hard level if you're not... If you're doing it on the original version with decent controls. This is a massive pain. If you're doing it on this version. Every time that happens, I'm going to have to restart. There's at least one side point here, but I don't know if there's only one. I don't know how much of this I'm going to show off. Okay, this is going to make things a lot easier. And it's gone rid of quite a lot of boxes as well, which is nice. Sometimes it's sometimes you just gotta go for this. It's it's just not worth it. I don't want to have to do I don't wanna to have to go for that again. The box that destroys all of those. So or the nitro.
Oh, I am getting close now. Strange that happened, but obviously that shark's not going to be very good for my health. I think I can probably go for the exit now, as long as I don't do anything really, really stupid. Now. Okay, good. I think I'm going to get all the boxes on Road Crash before I attempt the time trial on that. I don't know if the time trial requires you to get all the boxes or just to get to the exit. But I'm sorry, if the time trial requires me to get all the boxes then I am not going to do the time trial. If I get 99% out of 100% then fine by me. Uh, it's uh, it's not worth it. This isn't going to be the easiest time trial. Um, the easiest uh, box collecting. There's a uh, quite awkward prices here. All right, that's all the box is gone. So yeah, you don't you don't need to be in first place to get all these. Thank goodness. Look, Crass. I know the game wants to irritate me, but still, you, we got what we came for, Crash. There's no need to look like you failed. You didn't. See, you succeeded. Time to do the time trial. Good enough for me. Yeah, I... My hope is that it's just on the other side of this volcano. If I get any of these crates, then I'm gonna die. I am gonna knock into one of these bombs and I am gonna die. Yeah, I think I have to get all the boxes. Otherwise, the thing that would allow me to walk out of here would appeared by now. Besides which, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get it. All right, I am not gonna get 100%, but I will have a good go at getting um, all of the gems here. just avoid those or if you really want you can try jumping on their heads and why wouldn't you want that but um, I'm just going to avoid them when I can because it's easier So yeah, you can do that, which is quite fun. Actually, you can avoid a lot of stuff just by uh, jumping on here. Yeah. Oh, that's the double jump, see? Very helpful. If you're really lazy, you can just uh, stay on these walls and um, 
not have to do anything other than keep moving forwards. I remember, I know that I've gone, either I've gotten better at computer games or these walls weren't there and the original um, version of the game because I remember having a lot of problems with this level when I was a kid and uh, now I don't at all. Even the Kaizen we used to have problems with them, so... I defeated Gandalf. Sort of. Oh. Okay. Must have missed one. I am gonna have to go back, I guess. Apparently whatever I missed was very early in level, so I'm going to have to redo the level. And there we go. Right, I'm not going to, I'm going to do the time trial for that off screen. Um, I want to show you one more level. Um, I don't know how long this episode has been going on for. Hopefully not uh, too long for me to show you this. We will eventually be able to earn a coloured gem and then go back into these previous levels. In fact, I think Deep Trouble, which is in this uh, walkroom, is the one where we can get that.
this is quite cool. I like this. Uh, this thing can jump quite far. Uh, this is cool. Although, um, it can also get hurt, and when it does, it uh, sort of. Well, it disappears, basically. It decides that it's sick of putting its life in danger and goes away. But, uh, you don't vitally need it. So. I don't know if you can get all of the boxes without going on the, the death route or the gen path or whatever it's called. Probably not since there's 112 of them. Unlike on Class Bandicoot 4, um, they did the sensible thing here and uh, don't have incredibly long levels. And since this is the first level, I'm uh, expecting you to uh, go in here the first time, they give you the hint that you need double jump. I think that's the hint that you need double jump. Um, I could be wrong. It might be the hint that you need the belly flop thing to uh, break all the crates. Okay, yeah, we're not going to get 112 of these. I would really love to keep playing this all day, trust me, but um, I'm not going to. I'm in fact going to end the episode there because I'm sure it's been going on for long enough. I will see you next time.